as the Swapo Party is busy with deliberations on the 50-50 gender representation. Dr. Gurirab used the opportunity to narrate the tough historical background that Namibian women went through during the liberation struggle. It is the following day when in my case I reach Usakos and look at the headlines of the local newspapers and read this story. <coughs> that is when we realize what had happened on 10th of December 1959 and what we today call the Ventuk Massacre. The National Assembly Speaker, among others, pointed out Pendukeni Ivula Itana is one of the many Namibian women who stood the test of time during the tough days of the colonial regime. He said, by sacrificing their youthful years into exile does not only mean women are capable of fighting, but also being leaders of the nation. Women have always been leaders. It might have been our weakness as men to monopolize things. But every time that women have been given opportunity, they have been as good as men and usually better. He reminded the Namibian women that they have a vital role to play, especially in the upcoming elections, and that they ensure that Swapo Party remains victorious.